today we are checking out Flexbeat. Yes, that gross beat plugin is finally in standalone mode on any modern day MPC. Oh yeah. So let's start off by playing it on a sample. And the sample will be available in the description box. The link will be in the description box if you are interested in it. It is from Solace and from 16levels.com. So more about that a little later. Let's go ahead into the insert. Let's grab that effect. Let's turn it on. And it's on empty and you can see flex beat right in front of me. It's a flex beat player. So let's start off by playing with the scratch one. So now we got that natively inside of the MPC. We have reverse, we have gating and so forth. You can even go over here and play with like quantizing. Uh, you can do dry wet, so you can mix it in. So maybe you want that on uh, scratch. and so forth. I'm gonna go ahead and go with the dry wet. In editing, of course, you can do different things like pull up different factory presets within the patches. So you can see, you can rearrange it the way you want. And then, you know, of course, you can play with other aspects of it. You can, you have one shot mode. You have hold and the other thing about this that I want to make sure that you know is this Unfortunately, you cannot edit your own Preset like you cannot draw out on the grid like flex beat on the PC or like gross beat in FL studio I know I know guys. However, I'm not gonna allow that to stop my fun uh, What I will do is show you the other things about it as I will go back into performance mode and let's go ahead and run that sample. Uh, there are the classic presets like turntable. Get your Metro on, you feel me? Speaking of Metro booming, I wonder how he feels about this. I might have to holler at him. There's the gate, stutter effects. Let's go through stutter. Then you have patterns, basic one, basic two. Then you got bonus stuff. Then the classic half speed right here. And let's go ahead and mess with the dry wet. So that's a nice little idea for those who didn't know. I'm pretty sure you guys knew about that. Final off. So let's try it out on some hi-hats. So here's the track. And it has some intense hi-hat play in there. And what I'll do is I'll just go ahead and solo it. Uh, make sure that I have that pad selected with the hi-hat on there. You can tell because the the light is implementing that there is MIDI going through it. And then I'll just go to this particular track and grab Flex Beat again. So once I grab Flex Beat Player, I'll pull it up. I'll go to one of the bonuses and then we'll play from there. So I don't want it to be that slow the whole entire time, but I do want that taste, that flavor. So I'll just go ahead and Roll down the dry wet. And yeah, you can hear that the hi-hats are acting in the donkey now. Let's go to gate two. Final stop. And I'm just playing with different ones. Now I'll just go back and add it in the track. 
Now, don't sleep on it for like boom bap or any drum and bass style format of music or something like that. Jungle, let me show you something. So here's the track here. And the drum break we're gonna mess with. And I'll just keep it on the program itself or the track. And I will pull out another instance of flex beat. And pay attention, because it's gonna get crazy. So we have flex beat pulled up again. And you can hear the funkiness of it. I'm in initial right now. Let's go to dates. Let's go over here to the stutters. here break down the track so it gives that next level what we wanted for the NPC in terms of different details in the track like combining this with the probability effects makes this a little easier for your production to be more diverse Go ahead and try it out on another loop. And I'll go back in the main. And then as you can, you can do dry wet. And that's how that regular loop sounds like. I also will have it linked in the description box because these are breaks from 16 levels. I want to say congratulations to Tiffany for winning this Akai APC 64. She is our first week winner of our holiday giveaways at 16levels.com. If you want to know more about this, all you have to do is sign up for the mailing list and you can be entered into our weekly giveaway during the holiday season. We're doing one every week and you do not have to re-sign up for it every single time to re-enter the contest if you are someone that purchased something off of 16levels.com you are automatically entered you can stay eligible until the giveaways are done so to stay up to date all you have to do is make sure that you check out my community tab on the app mccree channel and you can see what giveaways are next the next giveaway will be the novation fl key 49 so make sure that you stay on the lookout for the announcement of the winner it will be at the end of this week so sunday will be the day that it will close and monday the person will be announced however i want you to be aware of scammers please be aware of scammers we do not have a telegram we do not have a whatsapp so do not reply to anybody that is on that type of BS please save yourself the drama and stay up to date with us on the community tab also we have a very good sale at 16levels.com all you have to do is enter the code holiday 23 and you will get 50% off of anything that includes bundle deals so don't sleep on us we have sample packs MPC courses on the modern day MPCs, preset banks, MIDI kits, MPC core progressions, and more. I'm not gonna hold you guys. I was actually surprised that we finally got that. I totally forgot about Flexbeat. You know, I was one of the many people that was raging like, why in the world is this a plugin from Air, but why we don't have any like standalone plugin of this plugin? I mean, I think everybody will want like a gross beat like plugin inside of the MPC. And voila, it took a minute. And by the way, it is $49.99 during the holiday season. So until the end of November. So be on the lookout, hurry up, make a decision now. And then after that, it will be about, I think $80. So we're talking about 50 or $80. So make your choice now. Now, my only con for it is that you cannot draw in the grid like flex beat or gross beat. And I can totally understand why it's like that because of the limitations of the current generation NPCs. And then it's just simple and sweet. I mean, you have all of the classic gross beat plugins or presets in there. So yeah, I mean, what do you guys think? To the right of me, I have more content for that ass. Make sure that you subscribe. Tell me how you feel about 
Flex Beat. Are you ready to have a gross beat like plugin inside of your MPC in standalone mode? Because now it's possible. Hmm. I definitely want to hear what you guys got to say about this. Hmm.